<laughs> oh, hello. We're live, hello. live this morning. We're not doing the countdown today. No, no, let's just start. Brilliant. Uh, <laughs> welcome along, everyone. Um, welcome. My name is uh, James. My name's Caroline, or Croggins, on Board Game Arena, if you want to play with me. Oh, that's true. I'm on uh, board. I should change my name to uh, what my name is on on Board Game Arena. It that? is. Um, it's Jars Bong. There you go. How did you do that? You just click on the thing with your name, and you can rename it. Oh. Anyway, I'm always learning. I'm failing to learn. Hi, Neil. Ooh, hi, Neil. We've got a. We have a Neil already. That's always nice. That's brilliant. So what we're going to do, uh, this is Learn Yourself Carcassonne with a UK Carcassonne champion, brackets 2015. But it still counts. Frankly, if uh, the England football team can ming on about 1966 for as long as they have, then I can ming on about this. Ming on, mate. Ming on, Jars Bong. This oh, is hello. the trophy. This is the trophy that proves that I won. Uh, it's it's very reflective, um, so it's, it's going to be hard to see what it says. It but says hold UK Games Expo 2015, UK Carcassonne Championship winner. Oh, although, Caroline, it doesn't actually say that. If you look closely, it says UK Carcassonne Championship it winner. Does. That's right. It there's a, there's a spelling error wrong. in the name of the game. That's amazing. So that, that's my how mom, uh, prestigious my that mom is. A, um, a certificate for uh, being in an exhibition of adult learners, but they spelt learners wrong and it said adult leaners. <laughs> so spelling mistakes are okay on on. Uh, yeah, it's, but anyway, I, I have a trophy. So there, I won. I won that tournament in 2015. I had to go to had to go to Germany to represent the represent the country, <laughs> uh, and uh, and I had a lovely time. That's all we need to say about how the World Championships went. Uh, so uh, this is what the box lids. Uh, the well, this is the second edition box lid of Carcassonne. Uh -huh. um, there. So uh, what you've got here, you've got uh, yourself. You've got a knight here who's checking out the the comely yeah. medieval wench down here mm -hmm. who's giving him short shrift. If I was in my normal um, gaming wear, I'd be wearing my yellow cape and mm. I would resemble her. But because this is a learning rather than playing, well, it's playing and learning, but I'm wearing my yeah. learning cape today, which is blue. Okay. Yeah. Maybe we could cosplay as these guys. Yeah, uh, have you got a red cloak? No, but you know, I I could find a red cloth or something. Yeah. A tea towel. Yes. Or such. Anyway, uh, so what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to use all my wisdom and knowledge and experience uh, to teach Caroline, who is a complete I have newbie. No wisdom, knowledge, or experience in any uh, realm. I'm going to teach you everything I know about Carcassonne. Uh, it'll take about five minutes. Um, <laughs> So, uh, Caroline, have you ever played Carcassonne before? Well, I said I haven't, but I have played it once about a year ago with my sister, but there were loads of kids running around and I didn't really know what was going on. Okay, first tip, first Carcassonne tip rivers. to be a winner. About rivers to, be a, and to, be, to be a winner is don't have loads of kids running around <laughs> when you're playing it. They are distracting. Yeah. So there you go, that's... We'll, break, we'll build up a list of tips. There's one. Okay, I'm writing that down. No kids. Don't have kids. <laughs> yeah. So what we need is a time machine and a condom. <laughs> mm. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to get a training game up on uh, Board Game Arena. We're going to put it up on the screen. And then I'm going to talk you through how to play it as we as we play. Uh, do you understand the basic principles of the game? No. Caroline. Okay, so um, now do bear in mind that Coxon is a bit too high octane for a lot of people. <laughs> so it is a game of collectively building a map of the medieval French countryside. Got it. And then putting little wooden people on it. Ooh. 
Um, and that, as we know, the, the wooden uh, people in the game of uh, Carcassonne, uh, they look like uh, this this sort of thing. Hello. Hello. They, that's what the board game arena um, icon is based on. Yes, they are called uh, Meeples. Meeples. Oh, is it, do they appear in lots of games? They appear in lots of games, but Carcassonne oh. was the first real oh. one to use this thing. Uh, Meeples was it was a term coined by um, a gamer in America uh, playing Carcassonne. She she came up with the name Meeples off the top of my head. Yeah, a woman. Uh, off the top, a woman. Uh, off the top of my head, I've forgotten her name, but it, you can yeah. find ears on the internet if you do the research. Do your okay. own research. Um, right. You can find why they're called meeples. Yeah. Yeah, um, meeples. So uh, you start the game with seven meeple. Okay, so the uh, plural of meeple is meeple. Presumably. Um, is the singular a person? Oh no, that's that would be that would be confusing. Uh, everyone would be expecting former England and Arsenal star Paul Merson. Um, no, uh, no, the, the, you, football. three strikes the out. Um, um, okay, uh, no, Amy, me, me, seven meeples you start with. Seven meeples. If you're if you're playing the game in real life, you actually start with eight. But the what? eighth meeple, the eighth meeple goes on the scoreboard. To keep right. track of the score, um, yeah. I love it. I love Coxon. It's a great fun game, but this scoreboard is rubbish. Yeah, uh, but there you go. Uh, Most but we're rubbish, though, aren't they? Yeah, or... yeah. Just keep it simple. Yeah, just keep it simple. I think. Um, but because we're going to be playing virtually using Board Game Arena, we don't need the eighth meeple. So we're, you start with seven meeples, and that's all you start with. Right. And there are seventy-two square right. tiles. In the game, uh, and uh, what, I'm, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to start the uh, they're square so that they can be orientated however you like. Ah, gotcha. um, I'm about to start the game and <laughs> to uh, share the screen. Um, let me see if I can get this to work. Oh no, here we are. There you go. You are going to play Carcassonne. Do it. No it's time limit. Time to get, time to get <laughs> your carcass on. Okay. You're waiting for me. Yeah, I accept. Waiting for Croggins. Okay. So that means the game can start. Here comes Ball Game Arena. Jars Bong must place okay. the title. So I'm a title. Place the title. Now, there we go. I gotcha. There's a tile in the middle of the board. Um. Let me just do that. Okay. Okay. Well, so can, can you see the, the tile in the middle of the board? Uh, that's the starting yeah. tile in Carcassonne. It consists of, it's got a road that runs all the way across, and, and it's now. got a little little bit of a city yeah. there. That's a right. city. Yes, yes, yes. That, that, the brown bit. There's basically three types of terrain. There's roads, which are squiggly lines. Correct. There's cities, which are the brown bits, and then there's the fields, which are the green bits. And you must always play orthogonally adjacent. Orthogonally? Yes. Adjacent. Uh, and uh, orthogonally is, is it's like the opposite of diagonally. Gotcha. Okay. Um, question? Yes. Uh, as you... Oh, oh, what happened? Um, you're not. It's not secret. I could look at you on on. I can look at the streamyard, right? Or is it? Yeah, you, in this game, yes, you can because we're because we're trading. That's fine. If we were playing competitively, I would ask you not to. So you can look on streamyard. That's fine. Because I can see what tile you have. Yes, I have a, a tile that has uh, just the a field and just a road. So what I have to do is, uh, helpfully, Board Game Arena sort of shades in the squares where yeah, you are allowed to yeah. play. Yeah. So I can't play that above the bit of city because that would it wouldn't continue yeah. the thing. It's a bit like dominoes oh, in that respect. Why couldn't you play your field next to the field at the bottom? What, like that? I could do that. Yes, that's fine. I could but, go there. Um, in. Hang on. Let me go back to your screen. Oh, that's because that's because you can't see the shading for my on my go. Oh, okay. So okay. I'm only shaded for what I've got. Yeah, 
and it won't it won't let me turn it to be to have the road pointing at the yes. field okay. because that would that would have a, a road going to nowhere uh, okay. and it's the talking heads rule you can't have a road going to nowhere so what i'm going to do on my first go is i'm going to put my tile there i'm going to continue that road so that road is now two tiles long and i'm going to confirm that tile placement and then mm. it's going to give me the option that i can place a meeple on that tile only on the one so, that you've just put you can only ever place on the tile you just laid down. Okay. Um, and there are a couple of places I could go there. I could go in either of the fields or I could go on the road. Oh. Now, uh, it, uh, if you place on a road, uh, you will score one point per tile of how lo however long that road is. And if you manage to complete the road by putting ends at either side or by making it loop round onto itself, uh, you scored those points and you get your meeple back to use okay. again. Otherwise, it just has to kind of stay there. So then once uh, he's on the road, you want to complete the road and get him back. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, right. Now, if I wanted to, I could put him in the field. The field is, it's the one complicated rule in Carcassonne and it's not even that complicated uh, and consequently I'm not going to talk about that now we'll talk about that as and when it happens so okay. for now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a meeple on that road does that mean then, if uh, I added to that road I can't put a meeple on it that's right that road now belong me the back um, road. so yes my hence the jumper uh, my uh, black squadron yeah. uh, uh, are starting already so i i own that road right now no one else can go on that road because i am on that road however oh. however it is possible to build a road next to it say maybe in the two spaces below it mm -hmm. uh, and put your meeple on it and then try and connect it up to the road that i'm on and then because if happen? if we both have the equal number of meeples on a feature then we both score the points Right, but it would okay. be giving you the points, but taking your points. Hmm. Yes. Uh, however, and then it could be possible for you to somehow get a second meeple on. Uh, and if basically, if you have the majority of meeple on a feature, oh. then you score all points for that feature. Right, okay. Okay, okay. so it's, it's, it's your turn, yeah. Croggins. You've got one of those sort of diagonally bits with right. uh, so you've got a, a a triangle of city and then a, a so road going across the court your, i could join onto your road but that would give you points so i would rather join onto the city yes that, that probably correct? makes sense yeah and and so is it a, and then i'll put a meeple into the city how do i get it if you if you want to would i mean that would make sense right I, i'm not sure how i drag the tile onto the oh i just click it there we go yeah i think so but i'm gonna rotate it okay no I, we can... don't we don't get to see it until you place it because we're using my stream yard but which okay. which end are you going to have the open bit of the city to the left to the left to the left the old beyonce move. Then, oh hang on that means i've got a road coming down towards you no, I just want to get away from your road robber. He looks like the robber from Settlers of Catan. Yeah. Um, there, in fact, the um, the name of the meeples on roads are thieves, I believe. Oh. Yes. Okay. By, and, yes, they're thieves. Yeah. By adding meeples to features, uh, the game says you have to call them names. So any meeple on a road is a thief. Uh, any meeple in a city is a knight. And when the city is completed, I get the points and get my meeple back. Oh, yes, we should point that out. So in um, in cities, they are worth one point per tile plus uh, bonus points if they've got a little flag in the corner. Oh. Uh, no. um, if you complete the city, you double those points and you get your meeple back. So if okay. if the if, if the if, if the city is three tiles big, 
Yeah, you and get it's six. completed. You get six points and your meeple back. If it's and three tiles big and it's not completed at the end of the game, you'll score three points. And if it's got a flag in it, what happens? You get that's worth like a boat, an extra point. Okay. So worth that'll be worth two points if you complete the city. So have I you placed know. your? I'm confirming the placement. Confirming the placement. All right. Now you're going to place your. I may place a meeple. I wish to. Yeah, you don't have to place a meeple if you don't want to, oh, but it kind of okay. makes sense to do. I'm going to go on the city. You're going to go there. All right. Okay. Uh, okay. So uh, that that seems like a good. Start. So if you can complete that city, you're going to get six points. I built this city. I mean, I could make it bigger than three. You could. But that's risky. Or I, I could try and sneak in on it. And get and it on your got, city. If you've got more meeples on it, then you'll get the point. Yes. Um, but but I, I, I don't have that tile. I've got this tile, which is a, a sort of a one bit of city at the top and then a and then a, a bendy road. Um, there, help you complete that system. No. Uh, interesting fact for you guys. There are only three tiles like this in a set of oh. cards. Um, so what I could do... Um, uh, if you look on uh, StreamYard, Caroline, you'll see me doing these options. Yeah. Um, so I could go there, which would mean my, my I mean, road is now pointing into your city, which means we have a, a yeah. we have a mutual um, need uh, for a tile to go there. So if you place a tile there, I am also yeah. going to benefit from you placing a tile okay. there. Tactics. Um, uh, there is no setting where if I could, if it was pointing the other way, I could maybe line up my that little bit of city to try and get in on your city, um, but I don't think I can. So what I think I'm going to do is I am going to do that that first thing there. It also makes okay. it slightly harder for you to complete that yes. city. Okay. Um, so I'm going to confirm that tile placement, and then I'm going to place a meeple in that little bit of city that's there. Okay. Uh, on the hope that I can complete that city. All right. Okay. Crogans, you've got a you've got, a, got a monastery. It's a monastery. Oh, he has to be surrounded by eight fields. That's that's the point. Yes, that's the aim of of the monastery. So, um, a monastery. Like yeah, a monastery scores points uh, for being completely surrounded. Uh, by other tiles. Oh, okay. No, yes, right. And then he's only got fields on his edges, so they have to. Yeah, those four will have to have fields on them. Um, so if I put him directly below the original tile, that makes it more difficult for you to get a big city there. Yes, but would you then put a meeple in that monastery? What What do I get from putting a meeple in it? Uh, you will score one point for every tile that you manage to put around it, plus one point for the monastery itself. So the maximum you can score for a monastery is nine points. Yeah, they are they are high scoring things. They're fairly tricky to always complete. Yes, uh, but if you complete it, you get nine points and your meeple back. There yes, are. But if you don't complete it, you don't get any points. No, you, you still score one point per thing. thing. Yeah, you still um, get one and point. It doesn't have to be me who places all the things. If I put it there, I've already got three points, right? You'll have four points. Yeah, okay, one for the thing. Okay. Mm. But why do you ask, am I going to put but, a meeple like it was a dangerous thing? Well, because the question is always, are you going to place a meeple? Okay. I mean, well, I'm... we can we can get into the the uh, more uh, advanced stuff if you want, but Carcassonne is essentially a gambling game. I think I'm going to put it there. Okay. Because I get three, I get those three points, and um, oh, you can't see, but um, and it makes your city difficult. Okay. I believe. But of course, we're okay. Are you going to put a meeple in it? Yes. If you like it, then you should put a meeple in it. Another Beyonce okay. reference. Uh, there are six monasteries in the game. Four of them look like that, like the one that Caroline has just played. Oh. Uh, the other two look like that. They're a monastery oh. that have ro a road access. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, now I've got what I've got here. Well, this is lucky for me. It is. Um, it, it is a little bit of city. It's a. It, I don't know what the names of these tiles are. I call. I call this a wanna. So you can finish off your city, city. And get your meeple back and get two points. Uh, I'll get four points because it's two tiles big times two. Oh. Okay. Okay. But also you're going to benefit as well because it's going to give an extra point to your monastery, which yes. means you're you're closer to completing it as well. So I'm going to yes. go there. Um, there's a possibility Ooh. that I could place a, a – Oh, put an extra could, meeple in it. No. I could I could place a meeple on, in the field. But not in the city. Uh, but not in the city, no, because I, I, there's already a meeple there. There's already someone there. It's already oh. occupied. It's, but if the, you, you know, it's, it's the public toilet rule. Someone's already in there, mate. But if you made a city by joining two cities that had started off in different areas with meeples in, then you would get – you. we'll get yeah, to it. If, you, if you, you start off separately and then join them up, that's then fine. They then you can oh, have more than one meeple. Point. You don't get double points. No. You just – No, no. You just beat the other person if they've got one in there. Yeah. Um, okay. What I'm going to do, just because this is a teaching game, is I'm going to place a, a farmer, which is what you call a meeple in a field. And farmers, <laughs> because they're French farmers, sure they lie down. They lie down. They lie that's down. So, so they Oh, that's such a. I never said they were lazy. Maybe they're doing something. Um, so, okay. Now, that mm. farmer means something. That farmer is there for the rest of the game. I cannot get that meeple back. All right. And at the end of the game, that meeple will score three points. What? For, for every completed city okay. that that field touches. Okay. At the moment, that field is touching one completed city, the city that I yeah. just built. So yeah. at the moment, that's worth three points. So it's now in my interest to build lots of cities around that field. Yes. Okay. And I can't go in the field that's adjacent to that. No, it's a feature and there's already meeple in it, so you can't go in it. However, um, and, it, you could go in another one and then join them up. That's fine too. Yeah. And if you were surrounded, once it's surrounded by a, a road, that's the cutoff point. Yes. The edges are uh, city walls, roads, and the edge of the board. Okay. Right, let's see what I've got. Mm. Oh. I think you've got a pretty good tile there, uh, Caroline. So I can I... complete. I can either complete my city and get yep. my meeple back. But that gives mm -hmm. you a point. Or I could start a new city. No, I couldn't. No. Well, couldn't. you could. You could I place could. it somewhere else. I want my meeple back. Did you miss right? it? Or her. I mean, yeah, it's a good idea, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, and that, then I can, a... It's a great idea. And then I can put a meeple in the, in the field. You could. But I'm but... not going to look like I'm going to get lots of cities in that area, does it? Yeah, because there's already a road that's sort of so I'm gonna, circling it. I'm it gonna might park. only have one city. Okay. And so I can't you're going to get. On the road. I can't no, because I'm already. No, because I'm already on that road. Okay, I'm past. Okay. Him. All right. So, um, okay. So you've got six points for that. So at the moment, you're Hello. in the lead. You're in the lead, Caroline, by six to four. Ooh. Um, Ooh, okay. Got I've got. City. Yeah, I've got one of my favorite tiles here. It's <laughs> the uh, it's the two city tile. Um, and well, oh, I'm going to place that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to place it. Um, Next area. to Ooh, like next to yeah, the uh, yeah, yeah. Hi. Mama. because remember it's in yes. my interest to have lots of cities touching that field. Um, yeah, so I can confirm that, and then I'm going to say, oh, do you know what? I'll I'll have uh, I'll Very go for cool. one of them. I'll go for that one there. Okay. Very good. And that's my go. Oh, By the road. way, uh, I'm going to. Oh yeah. 
I just say the game keeps going until we run out of tiles. So you can see in the in the top right corner it says sixty two tiles remain. I know that seems like loads. The game will get quicker. <laughs> okay. I'm placing my new road, and I'm going to put okay. a meeple on the road. Okay. All right. Um, uh, the city with a road coming out. An umbilical yeah. Cord. We've, got, we've got a big old bit of city and uh and uh, one bit of road now that road going into the city means that's an end of a road uh as boys that to men once so. <laughs> and now we've come to okay. the end of the road uh, uh so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put that at one end of my road oh uh, because i want that road i want that road to end so that i can get my meeple back and score some points Right. Uh, I'm, I'm going to confirm that tile placement, and then I've got a decision whether I place. Well, I could place in the field at the top, but I don't think that's going to be worth many points. Or I could no. place in the city, which is a big, yeah. a big tile. It's got three ends, which so means it's, it's going to take a lot of work to finish. But, but it, it should be very rewarding if you do. Yeah, and, and it's it got a flag. Like it's got a flag, so it's worth an extra point. Uh, and we're still quite early in the game, so I think, yeah, yeah. I'll give that a go. I'm going to have a go at that. Uh, you know, it is, it's a gamble, isn't it? It's an Ed Gamble. Right. Croggins, you're up with your bendy corner road okay. bit. Now, I've got a new road. I could work on my um, temple and make it make that city difficult for you. Could I? You could. You could, yeah. Or I could extend the road I have up there. You could, I feel yeah. like, what is he called a temple? Monastery. You can call it what you want. Some people call them cloisters. Uh, the rules say monastery. Oh. But, and that also helps me to sort of enclose your... Does it help me to enclose your naughty farmer? <laughs> Why is my farmer naughty? Because he's stealing my points. Um, well, he's not. He's he's getting me points. It's got nothing to do with you. All right, so you, yeah. you're going to go there. All right. Now, you can place a meeple on that road if you want. Okay, you have. There you go. All right, so, again, that means that twice. my city over there on the uh, right, I don't know. Can yes. you see my cur cursor on the screen? Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, that city there now it's in it's going to benefit you if i put a piece underneath it because it's yes. going to add to your road now i've got another yes. one i i am yeah i'm getting some lucky tiles here which can happen in the game okay, you can get your meeple back over there yep i could do that or i could also do this i could go here and pick up four points for that what? city literally jump in jump okay. out it's mine and okay. what that means is that the field where the farmer is is now worth six points because it now touches two completed Absolutely cities. Absolutely sickening. Hey, that's Carcassonne. <laughs> oh, I've got uh, two pieces of pie. I've got no yeah. open cities. How about I go under the under my boardwalk? That is that going to be difficult? Are you saying in the piece directly underneath your monastery? Yes. Um, it's going to make it. W if we were playing a competitive mm -hmm. game, it would make it very easy for me to block you in. Okay. What does block you in mean? In Carcassonne, you can block your opponent because there are some tile configurations that don't exist in the game. Oh, okay. We okay. won't put it there so, then. For example, a tile with one bit of city and one road does not exist. So I know that if, if, you if, put that's, a road, the yeah, if that's a gap yeah. that I leave, it can never be filled. Just, well, just to, we, are, we are playing with the base game only. Sorry, okay, Carl, so sorry then that, I said whenever you leave, it's a gap that can never be filled. Oh. Um, yeah. So I can't see many places that I can put it, so I'm going to put it there. Oh, you can't see. I'll just do it. Well, th there is a place you could go. 
top top right. Uh, I was going to say. I don't want to. You see, help. I don't want to help your on city. The, oh, okay. the, on the bottom yeah. left here, if you placed in this square here, yeah, with one city at the top, and you put a meeple in that city at the top, I'll then I'll, okay, you'd be difficult you'd be getting some points here. But, right. It but also, gives you more your farmer. It would help my farmer as well. But at least, look, it looks like I'm going to do that anyway. So you might as well score some points out of it. You could do that. Or you could but just I'd also be opening up a new city for you. Because there's two cities. Online. But if you went, what if you went, if, if you went, here, sorry, Caroline, if you, yeah. if you went here, mm -hmm. the field that would exist below these two cities is not part of this field because it doesn't join up. Well, it might do in the future. It might do in the future, but right now it doesn't, which means that someone could put a farmer I in here. Right. <sighs> so Kakasan is a game of, you know, decisions and taking a chance. Yeah, I'm not very good at G those. Gambling, if, if you will. Can I just say hello, a big hello to everyone who's actually watching this this morning? We we have actually got uh, a whole bunch of viewers. Everyone in the world. Have is we? Watching. Uh, yeah. We if you're watching on, you can uh, comment on Twitch and we can see your comments. Oh, yeah. uh, and uh, we'd love to. to... My, um, tell me where to place it because I'm thinking it should go up next to my yellow guy. Here. Hang on. Yes. Right. The problem with Start that is. It makes this road difficult. Makes that oh, like road you difficult said, to complete. No, impossible there, there, to complete. Well, there would there is a piece that can go there. There is a piece like the starting tile, which has a road yeah. all the way across and one bit of city. But if I went here, I could block you in, and yeah. then that road okay. is couple. And, and likewise, if I put it next to, uh, oh, you can't see my cursor, can you? Um, if I put it down and left and left from that top yellow guy i'm going to give you a new city so i think i'm going to take your hint and put it where you suggest that's all right with everybody mm -hmm. which is also the name of caroline's oh, only yeah. fans channel if that's all right with everybody or i'm going to put it where you suggest <laughs> yeah the second one <laughs> <laughs> it's a it's a it's a feng shui channel everyone calm down <laughs> pop him in yeah there, there we go. go right which has prevented me so because what i would have done on my next turn had you not gone there is finish that city with the tile i have right. here um you but now i can't i've given you but i can go there so you know swings and roundabouts yeah. boing so boing in and out Boom, which is the name of which is the name of my OnlyFans channel. Um, okay. Ooh, look at this. You've got a corner with a bendy road, and it's got a flag in it. Crumbs. Well, maybe I should put that above my um, road at the top because then I I extend my road and I start a new city. Yeah. What do you think no, of that reason? Yeah. I'm not going to um, put yeah. it on your side. No. Or I could close the city, but then I'm giving you an extra point. I could close the city that we're both involved in. You could, if that, you close uh, that city, you could also yeah. put a farmer next to it and try and connect that farmer up to the big Ooh. field that's developing. You could do that. Or you could continue your, your road at the top of the board. I don't know I which don't... of those is the right thing to do because we don't know the order that the tiles are going to come out in. The tiles come out in a I random think order. I pull back if I do that. I think I do that. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm... Oh, it's not offering me that as a possibility. Where? Huh? Of where? To do what you suggest to close that city. Here. Hang on. It should. It should do. Yeah, it's not... I know it should. It's not though. That's weird. Why? How weird. Oh, Should it isn't. Go. It wasn't shaded, but it's let me put it there. 
Huh. Okay. Okay. Oh, right. that is okay. What? No, it's all right. Are you watching on your streamyard or on your uh, board I'm game watching arena? On my board game arena. Right. Oh, I'm we've, some, there. we've had some oh. comments in. Sorry, I haven't seen the comments Ooh. come in. We should have said hello to all these people. Uh, hello. Hello. Hi, Neo Akira, Neo Akira, seventy. And uh, and Lippy J, that one incredible. That one incredibly piece of flavour. Oh, we we've I, I, missed I time know. it. Sorry, yeah, Lippy J. We don't know what that oh. referred to. Lippy J's come back. That was it. To thieves, yes, the thieves on the road, yes. Thank you, Lippy J. Mm, delicious. Um, Do apologise for not getting to your comments sooner. I'm still learning yeah. how to use all this. Right, I'm going to put it there. Confirm it. Okay, so we're going to both get points for that because we're both in it, so it's eight points each. And then, uh, three for the tiles, one for the flag, and double it. And I'm going to put my farmer into the road right next uh into the field right next to the um city right that's good idea it's a yeah. gamble yeah okay yeah Ooh, i feel so like what you're you can getting... try and do now is mm. now yeah uh okay if we were they... playing a competitive game where I hadn't just suggested you do that. Right. Uh, I would take the piece that I've got here and I would put it yeah. here, which blocks that meeple from connecting that's there. Okay. And then I, you, um, I, and then yeah, I that's okay. that. And then I would place a meeple in this field here. So even if you did manage to connect that up over the that's top, more. I yeah. could connect it up there and I'd be two one up. Okay. Um, because it is a friendly training game. I'm not going to do that. No. Oh. Uh, but what I am going to do is that. Oh, hang on. Turn it around. There we go. I'm going to add to my big city here. Yeah. Wow. Um, uh, which means you need there are, you need a corner yeah, piece right. or a monastery with a, a road Ooh, to go here. Yeah, yes. So uh, I'm going to confirm that. Um, I we'll could place a meeple in the field, but it's not worth it. So I'm not going to. I'm just going to pass. Okay. Oh, pieces of pie. Oh, one of my favourite pieces. I could, I could join up. I could get involved in your city, couldn't I? Uh, how? By by putting it next to your city thief and putting a meeple on it. What, down here? Um... No, to the right, right hand side. Here. No, further. There. No, further, all the way over on the right. Oh, okay. Are you going to try and get in on my city? Yeah. Oh, yes. That's a, yeah, you could do that. That's legit, as the children say. But hang on a minute, because you were going over there. Is there something I can do? I could increase my monastery. Again, like you said, that's not good. Or what? The, the, yeah, that thing about getting in the city, that's, yeah. that looks like a good thing to do. That's kind of what that piece is really good at doing, is getting in on someone's yeah. big old city. There's no um, point in me starting a new city down. Although, no, that would block. No, yeah, I think I'll do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, because the other thing I was going to say is if you went down here, this mm. field here that is only two tiles big at the moment is worth nine points because it touches three completed oh. cities. Now, it's very likely that will join up with that one. So that's actually um, a really good place. So, but you've got this opportunity to play and steal a city to get in on a big city. Uh, oh, uh, Adam Haycox claiming that field bottom left is really good. Okay, Not Adam my Haycox. words, Caroline. The words of Any, Adam Haycox. Anyone, anyone uh, want to advocate for stealing the city? This is nail-biting stuff. It is. Uh, 
Yeah, I like this because I feel like I'm not happy about your farmer getting all these points. So I think I'll go and get in, in on that field. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to pop him down there. Uh, okay. You've got to decide there. which way around to put it. Are you going to have a, the city at the top or at the bottom? Well, there's a road there. Does that make it a bit tricky? You also don't want to block in the, the farmer you've already got. No, exactly. You want to make it easy. You want to make it easy for that farmer to be able to join up with other stuff. Yes. To join in with all the uh, farmer games. Fun. The farmer games. There Lippy we go. J has a question. Which option what? is worth more points to you? Um, well, we don't. I can't relate these things. We um, we don't know yet. You're a bit of a Yoda, aren't you, Lippy J? Riddle me this. <laughs> I think um, that's a compliment, Lippy Joe. I think that's a compliment. Oh yeah, baby Yoda. Um, you can't. I guess you can't tell because you don't know how big the city's going to be, yeah. and you don't know how the field's going to pan out. Yeah, but the field yeah. looks like it's it's scoring a lot of points already. It does. Uh, but so you've got a really good field chance field. of winning that field right now. Uh, with with the piece that I've got, I could continue my big old city up here. That tile is worth two points. Oh, or no. what I could do oh. is I could go down here because I'm now worried about you stealing all the farmer points. I like you being worried. I confirm that there. I am ignoring the fact that that's a really good city that started and You're you can in jump field. in and grab eight points because I'm going to go in that field there in the hope right. of, you know. Can you see my upcoming tile when you're placing uh, yours? Not until I've not until I've placed, then I can see yours. Okay. Which right. is how the game's supposed to be. Okay, that's cool. Because on the first go, I could see your tile. Yeah. That was I didn't have a tile yet. Right. Uh oh. That doesn't help okay. me complete that city. Got a bit of straight road. I could put it down near where you just put yours and put another farmer in the field but then i'm losing all my meeples i've only got two meeples left it what field would you put a farmer in as far as i can see all those fields have farmers in right now yeah yes yeah, so that's useless i might add to my road and do a bit of road works or okay. add to can i close off or not close off a field oh. Oh, it gets so many choices. There's so many choices. So many choices. <laughs> if you went um, here, sort of in the t in the space above yeah. your second your second farmer, that would mean that this field have would have two of your farmers in. Yes. And then you would and need to begin. join that up to to end. be the yeah. Now it's very likely that I'm going to be able to get in on that as well here. So. But I could put a meeple on the road because I'm what, intending to consider the possible futures. You must. <laughs> there he is again, <laughs> J. Lippy. Um, you defy me. Okay. Um, guide me, Lippy J. So I'm just worried about losing losing all my meeples. And uh, how many tiles have we got left? Does it say fifty-two? Oh God! We should be done we by need, Tuesday. I need to start closing off some city. You're getting some meeples back. Close off some cities. That guy up there on the road on his own. He's not doing anything. If I put the, my road above. Um, so you were pointing out that one on the left, but if I put yeah. it on the one, yeah, if I put it one to the right and one up from there, that would go yeah. away to closing off the, no, but I could close it off with the city. Hmm? Are there easier why ways do you, to close Why do you need off? to close it off? I don't know. <laughs> A straight road down Look. from next to Jake's placed could help win the field again. Jake's placed. Adam Haycox, thank you. Um, a straight road Who's down. Jake's? Who's yeah, Jake? Oh, yeah, he has corrected. Jake's. 
a straight road down from next to where James just placed, which seems like weeks ago now. Where did you just play? Oh, <laughs> well, you just placed the city. No, what did you place? That the 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 bit right bottom left, the most bottom oh, lefty time. That would help me do what? Win the field again, would it? No. Enclose you. No, I don't. I don't think that's the case. To be honest, but Adam just pointed oh, out it does get a bit silly number of meeples. You don't want to be spending all your meeples on a, a city, on a field. Yeah. Sometimes this happens. It's usually with fields or big cities that the what, whole I've thing just becomes somewhere. a war of attrition. I've spotted somewhere, and I'm just going to go ahead and do it without. All right. Um, okay. There we go. Okay. All right. Yeah. It's a. It's a point for what? your monastery and a point for your road. So exactly. Um, uh, sorry, I'm having a family discussion. I oh, cannot. Okay. I cannot. What? Oh well, bring my phone in and maybe I can. Right. She wants to. Okay. Uh, uh, she just wants to break some um, um, laws about. Uh, <laughs> Um, intermingling, right? What do you call it? Lockdown, right? No. Oh, what happened? Did you do something? Oh, I don't want to. I'm, I'm going to pass. I'm gonna pass. Okay, you're going to pass. All right. Well, I uh, also have a. I could Sorry? have gone in the field, but like you, you said, you could have gone in the field on the right. But oh no, no. Okay, right. Yeah, no, no. I need to keep my guys. <laughs> Okay, I am. Uh, I could add to my. I could add Big to the M one that I'm building up here. Sorry, newsflash. My daughter's just made Angel Delight for the first time. Uh, do let me know if anybody wants any. Back to the game. <laughs> <laughs> it's the perfect Sunday Elevens as treat. Yeah. Um, looks a bit running. Um, I could add to the M1 that I'm building up here. The M1 is what I call any long road in Carcassonne because I'm hilarious. You are. Uh, but what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to join up my farmer to this farmer's field down in the bottom left. Uh, I'm going to confirm that. I'm not going to place on the road. I'm just going to pass. You want some? Yes, please. Um, okay, now it's my turn. Question. Oh, is it butterscotch? Lois, what flavour is it? I'll find out. She's bringing me some. You can watch me eat it. Um, <laughs> that's my other only <laughs> fans channel. <laughs> 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 right. I didn't know this was going to descend into filth. I could join up your city. I could join that city. I could. There's nobody in that city down there at all. Nope. Nope. It's there? an empty city. There's no one in the city. It's a it bit could, like how things are at the moment. <laughs> it could be huge, right? If it I put could my be part, massive. If I put my part down there, that could be huge. And, it, and it's And it's... Stop it. And it also, <laughs> it prevents me from getting it, doesn't it? If you take yeah, it. Yeah. Oh, that way round. We can't see what way around you're putting it. So I was imagining putting it with the um, edge going to the left. The field on the left field hand side. The left. But when I popped it there, it, the field is on the bottom, and that makes more sense, I suppose. Okay. Does it? It makes it harder for me to get in on it. It makes it harder for me to, to steal. But it doesn't close off your field with all your farmers in. No. Mm, oh, I don't know. What's best? Guide me, Yodas. I just put it there. Put it there. No, they just want to know about Angel Delight at the moment. I know it's exciting, isn't it? Ah, yeah. I've got to meeple it. Ooh. Yeah. All right. So, okay. Okay. I <laughs> those knew what it was going to be. Right, can anyone... There, it, oh. it, it, it is traditional after 23 tiles have been placed that you stop for Angel Delight. <laughs> uh, 
It's a house rule. Weird. It looks like strawberry, but it tastes like butterscotch. What? Gross. This isn't what I remember Angel Delight being. Oh, it's really great. It's horrible. Oh, okay. Thanks, now, I've got a cur I got a curvy bit of road here. Are we still doing this? Oh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Play to the end. <laughs> I got a curvy bit of road, so I could go here and join up the the fields, which would mean I would be winning the big field two to one, mm -hmm. and then Caroline has to connect up her fit farmer from here. Mm -hmm. um, I could add it to my road here for oh, a yeah. point. I could go there and try and get in on this road, but it's only with two. I could go there and sort of try and block you, but there are two pieces that could go there. Uh, so that might go hideously wrong. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, even though that gives you a point for your monastery, it means you're only one square away from uh, completing your monastery. I'm going to go there and join up this big field. So currently that big field, which is worth one, two, three, four, 12 points, uh, is being won by me, two meeples to one. No. Oh. Yes, it, yes, it is. Because your yeah. second meeple is not connected to it yet. Oh, um, we in the monastery. <laughs> oh, yeah, that goes in the monastery. Uh, so I'll just pass that. And it's... It's delicious. Two... Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? No. <laughs> you know, she doesn't like it. Oh, uh, well. Uh, well. Right. Um, is it my go? It is your go. You have uh, a piece that I call the bow tie. Oh, yes. Because it looks mm. a bit like a bow tie, a, a okay. brown bow tie. Exactly one meeple left. That's not going to help me close anything. <sighs> what an idea. No, that won't work. Those tiles are handy in very specific circumstances that sadly do not exist in this game at the moment. Uh, uh, well, <laughs> <laughs> the sarcastic sound effects you're in. <laughs> that does can't go there. Could go. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Lois. <laughs> oh, number one rule was don't have kids around while you're playing. <laughs> that was the number one tip. Well remembered. <laughs> Um, us. yeah, okay. Um, no. Lois, go away, please. I've got there's many people excitedly watching to my next Are move. Sure? I'm certain of it, right? I've got not got okay. <laughs> she thinks no way to do that. Nobody even knows about it. Um, it's not true. Okay. Lippy, um, Lippy J knows. Right. Do you know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to add to my giant city because it doesn't take away from it. I, I can still close it. And it's got a flag. I'm yeah. going to put them there. Okay. Makes sense. And I'm not going to do anything with my meeple. All right. Even though, no. I mean, the fields, the fields. No. The fields, the fields. All right, I have the one and only crossroads tile. Woo! Crossroads tile. There's only one crossroads tile in the game, and I've got it. Now, ideally, what I'd like to do is finish my road on the top right here. But I can't, because someone built a road here, which means I can't play it. Uh, so I'm going to have to go somewhere else. Uh, otherwise, I'd be looking for, like, a little road that's maybe too two squares big that I could just jump in and take the points. They don't exist in this game right now. So what I'm going to go is I'm going to go here. Yeah. And then I am going to put a meeple on a road here because one end of it is already completed and it's got three tiles. Yeah. So okay. that's what I'm thinking there. Um, right. No, please don't sit there. This is really... Um, <laughs> Uh, well, then you'll love Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ah. Okay, so I can clump up that. It's getting big, isn't it? Oh, there it is. 
I could get in on your big city. No, I've only got one meeple. I'm going to close off my my city at that end and start a new road. Or is that road that is that road I've got useful uh, in my tile? You only have one meeple left, so. Yeah, so I don't want to put any. You yeah, don't want okay. to be going all. It's it's a good idea to avoid going all in, unless it looks like you're definitely yeah. going to get one back in your next go. Okay, Done so you're going to go there. All right. Uh, okay. Can I just say I'm not sure about um, why the cities look like scabs. Uh, well, they're, they're medieval cities, aren't they? So they're mainly mud based. <laughs> mud and blood. Yeah. And tomatoes, says my daughter. Uh, okay, I am going to. Uh, this is this is where my championship brain. Oh no! Comes into what play. Got? I, I've got, got a, a bow tie. tie, so I'm going to go here. What's here? Oh, by the. By the way, I can't go because you haven't decided whether you're placing oh. a meeple or not. Oh, I have decided, but I don't haven't told it. Yeah, you have there to you tell go. that. What? So I'm going there. How dare you? you I'm going to confirm the placement. Please. At the moment, that city is not connected to anything because even though it's diagonal, a diagonal does not count as connection. So I'm going to go in there, which means if we can complete that up, I'm going to get in on the points. And that is how you play Carcassonne like a boss. You let everyone else do the work and then you show in at the last minute and take all the credit. You know, like a boss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, got a little roadie one. <gasps> I can complete my monastery. Will I get my dude back? Yes, you'll get you'll get nine points and your dude back. So I think that's like a good idea, right? Okay. Or not. It and I can make... put a thing on the road because I'm quite likely to connect that road. Yep. Right? Yep. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. So nine really points. In? No, I'm not really. Yeah. You are in the lead. Twenty three points to twenty. You are winning. Like so. six limit all over again. Yeah. Uh, I am going to go there. So finish that road, and I'll get four points of my meeple back. Confirm and pass not placing a new maple okay. lois please can you go away i've sent the message you asked me to do okay and i'll let you know when it happens oh. family life right tell me again what you did uh, i went at the bottom of the screen the, the most <laughs> southerly <laughs> tile got some points got your maple back and you yeah. are now in the lead by one point yes that was short lived okay Wow. You got another bit. You got a bit of road here. Another bit of road to hang myself on. Uh, okay, I could extend the road that I've got to the right of the one I just put it on. You could. Uh, I could put it. I don't. I didn't really no. realise when I was putting guys on roads at the beginning how annoying they were going to be. <laughs> Your road men annoying you. <laughs> My road thieves. If I extend that road, like I just said, I'm not really blocking off my... No, I'm going to make it more difficult to complete the road to the left. Well, no, because you, well, you, really, you need a bend, don't you? A bend completes it either yeah, way. There's some bends that have got something else on the side. That's true, there are, but a, a, bend, a, a bend is the most common tile in the game. Is it? Yeah, there are okay. nine of them. All right. So that seems like the most useful place to put it, really, or at the top. Or, no, no, yeah. Okay. Or, or, or you can join up that field and get that farmer in on the points here. Hang on, what field? 
You know your field, you've got one farmer and one city. Oh, I'm going to look on yours to where you show me the curse. One farmer yeah. and one you got, city. you got this guy here. Yeah. If you placed there, yeah, it would be joined up, and then we'd be sharing the points of oh, the okay. field. Oh, right. Okay. Um, I'm going to do it, mate. Not All a problem. Right. Bring it. See if I care. Okay, it's going to be difficult to close that up, isn't it? Isn't it? What? Is it going to be difficult to close that up? Close what up? That field. Why, why do you want to close it up? Oh, you never have to close it up? Well, no, you never get your people back, so you might as well make it as big as you can. Mm. Hello, hang on. It might be difficult to close the city, though, or not. It's always worth thinking about farms, Lippy Joe. What is a farm? A farmer's lying down in a field. What is a farm? A farm is a field with a farmer in it. Okay. Called I mean, what are, we are thinking about them, aren't we? Yeah. More fields. Right, it's my go. What can I do here? I've got uh, these tiles are quite handy. I mean, I could just go there, which means we're close to completing this, but it's not really in my interest. I, I, it's in my interest to join that up. Um, mm -hmm. But it's not really in my interest to complete it because I've got a one point lead and we'd share the points anyway. So, mm -hmm. um, but where else could I go? Not really much going on. And also, you know, you've got, you've used one more meeple than me. So it's not in my interest to give you your meeples back. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go up here, just add to my big city in the corner. Why the hell not? Ugh. All right. You've got a one -er. Oh, hello. What? You've got a wanna. Well, I'm going to look into it and have a think about what you... So I could go where you had just suggested, but like you said, I'm sharing the points with you. Well, you can't go there anyway because you don't have a road. Oh, yeah, so. Okay. But there is somewhere you could go, which uh, is a risk because you would have to go all in. Uh um but it looks like you have to go all in anyway if you're gonna go play this city. yeah you could get in on my city so my my oh i'll just put this here out the way would have yeah. backfired okay i'm going to place it to the right and down from where you just went and i'm going to confirm and i'm going to meet uh, all. What? what no not there oh. <laughs> Space above it. Why? Thanks. I don't understand. What? That's connected. Oh, okay. oh, can I undo it? No. Oh. It asked you if you were sure. I did. Yeah, I forget about the. Yeah, right, right, right. If you get to the right where James has just been, look, Adam saw it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, well, look, it's the first game. It's fine. Oh no, I'm really upset now. So <laughs> it's okay. I might open my gin and tonic. Okay, well I'm not going to place my meeple. No, okay. I'm not gonna find my angel delight. Uh I've got the same piece as I had last time. Um I'm really upset and angry. I need you to use that piece to help me. <laughs> what what? Tape. Tape. Lois, I'm busy. <laughs> um, what I'd probably do in a competitive game is um, the demeanour of a champion. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> or indeed what that is a picture of. This is the legacy version of Cag. Someone's this place, it can't be moved. No, well, it's the online version where it won't let you undo. Um, well, 
You shouldn't once you place a piece in any game, you shouldn't really uh Yeah. But when you think when you when your fingers come off it, I think that's it. I think if you keep your fingers on it, I think you're allowed to then move it again. Yeah. But my, my um, fingers never really touched that. I'm opening my gin. If I um well it is twenty past eleven on a Sunday. Uh if I was playing a competitive game, I would definitely go here. That would make me really difficult for me to um close my road not really difficult because those pieces do exist and there are probably about three or four or probably more than that actually how many would there okay. be and then actually three. then give me some if i do get that piece then i get lots of points there would be yeah you get well you get this meeple back uh and there are six t tiles in the games remaining that could go there so it's okay. not really a block. So I'm just going to go over there. I said I wasn't going to do it, but I've done it now. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. The person oh. who did the thing has become the person who did a thing. This monster again. What do you call this? Bum cheeks. <laughs> now I do. <laughs> right. It's good. It's a good way to end a road. Is it? Yes. Um, there, there is, in the game, Caroline, there is one tile that looks like that. It's just all city all the way around. Yeah. Hang on. One that, tile that looks like what? Oh, that. Right. Looks oh. like that. There's one of those in the game. So that means if you went here and put a meeple in it, and then you drew that tile, you could pot it there, and then you'd get all the points for this city. But My you'd, lo you'd, you'd lose your last meeple, and if I drew that, you... I'd, prob I'd probably put it somewhere else. But if there was nowhere else for me to put it, I would have to play it there. Mm. If you can play, you have to, even if there's only one place for it to go. Okay. So there's a gamble in it. Options. Because mm. that city down there is going to be worth a lot of points. Uh, one, two, and three, I four, can... five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, okay. twelve. It's at least 26 points if you I do that and pull it off. Left. Say again. Oh, and I put my meeple in it so I get all the points. And yeah, you don't you get points i get none of the points and i just have to hope hang on how yep. do i hang on but i can't put that there because i haven't got a road what are you talking about here You're... yeah there's no road oh. in in my oh, green. oh yeah that's because i'm looking at the wrong piece sorry you're looking at your own <laughs> I am, yeah. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Well, good luck with that. So that I'm, I'm not gonna you, do it. you can take that risk next go, nah, but I can't. Nah, not gonna. Oh no. Okay, so I just have to basically start off a new city. I could go. I've got one guy. I don't really want to spend a farmer, do I? When I've only got one guy. Yeah. So I'm thinking I could put him... Um, see, I've got like a row, a diagonal row of three yellow farmers. Yeah. I mean, a uh, meeple. Yeah. Um, I was thinking I can go up to and right one from there. And put him in a field? Oh, go away. No, that field would be connected to an already existing field that has me. Oh, God. Yeah, this is what I don't see. That's why I put my thing in the wrong place last time. Um, okay, so I could go over here underneath my road to the, to the right of my road. I could just, I just need to like start a new one. Well, where, what should I do? If there's nowhere that helps you, is there anywhere that hurts me? Hey, 
I don't know. Can you answer that question in your own mind? Well, look, uh, all right, this is a bit, here's a bit more uh, of an advanced Carcassonne theory. Uh, at, the, at the bottom of the board, underneath the city that is not yet complete on the left, yeah, there is this field here, which yeah. has no farmer in it, yeah, and would be reasonably easy to connect up to the big field, thus saying whoever goes there can basically have a really good chance of stealing all the points of the field. Wow. Uh, if you place that tile there, you would yeah. essentially you would block that off. Which means no, no one could go there. I can't have it, and you can't have it. Yeah, I mean, it's still possible that someone could, but it would be much, much harder to connect up. And you're and so more... crazy, and you've got more meeples. I'm going to do it. Okay. Okay. Unless anybody tells me not to. If anyone knows of any just cause or impediment why this woman should not place this tile in this place. Let them speak now or forever hold their peace. Anyone? Anyone? Going? Going? Gone. Okay. Not that way round, Caroline. Um, and I'm not placing my meeple. Okay. Pass. All right. Uh, it's my turn. Uh, I am going to finish the big city. So we're going to Enjoy. both get <coughs> both get a load of points for doing that in a minute, but I am going to place a meeple in the here, field. In that tiny bit of field there. I detest so you. <laughs> thank you, which is currently <laughs> worth three points. Oh, no. And I just need to hook, connect it up. So I would quite like you not to be able to connect that up. That is correct. So I would like to block you somehow. Yes, that would be good okay. for you. Oh, I can connect it right up for you right away, sir. Yeah, just do that. Um, <laughs> hang on, hang on. Then. It's a curve. Can I place it there? Yes, I can get my meeple back. Okay, so some points coming to Caroline. Uh, so we both scored uh, 20 points. Did we? 20 points for that big city. Now, I'm going to get... Shall I... I'm going to get my... Um, road man back. So, shall I put one in this city? Am I likely to get good points from this city, or should I hold on to my new ball? Well, that's that's the that's the game. That's if the game. Get, guys. That's the question if, I'm asking. Where's Jay Lippy? Where's you, um Howler? Uh, you've got two meeples already in your uh, reserve, uh, and uh, you're going to get that one back as well. So that's three. So, yeah. So, unless I want to really go for it in the field fight. Lippy says, I don't answer questions. I just ask them. Okay. Ask me a question, Lippy J. The Oracle. So, what are you doing? Are you placing a meeple or what? Oh, are they? Um, yeah, of course I bloody am. Okay. No idea. Not in the field, anyway. Okay, here's the annoying thing. Oh, what? Had um, I used had I used my tile previously yeah. to do the thing I told you about about stealing it, I would be now stealing that thing. But, but so I didn't. Cowardly. You were so cowardly. I played it safe, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Now there is only one place I can play that tile. Where I just played it. Yeah, and the game says if you if you have if you can play a tile, you have to play a tile, even if there's only one place for it to go. So, uh, Karen, you're going to get that, which is going to give you a couple of points, but it's going to make it much harder to complete the city. Okay. And I can't place a meeple because you're already there. So. Okay, what have I got? Good. Ooh, <laughs> your road ship. Ooh. Like, uh, that will close off a road. On yep. one end, which yep. where have I got road characters over here? Oh no, can't do either end of that, but I can do one end of that. That's the only one. Yeah, the top one here. So I'm going to do that, right? Does right. that make sense? 
I mean, yeah. The other places to go would be down at the bottom and just pick up two points for completing this tiny road here. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah. Okay. You get two points for going there. Or going here, which would make it harder for me to complete that. Not impossible, though. There are still four or five tiles in the game that would let me do it. Hang on. Oh, let me see. Here. Uh, but my road, if I put that there, that does complete that field. No. What? Doesn't no, it? No, here. Here. No, here, above oh, it. Here. Yes. Oh, okay. Because yes. that so means I'd need a T shape to go into that gap. Okay, the gap right. Okay, yeah. That I need. And so where's the bit? Can, thank you. Where's the bit I can get points from? You can get two points for putting it here. Hmm. Two points. What are the what's the points situation? I have forty four. You have forty seven. Ooh! I really want to make it difficult for you, so Thanks. I'm going to do it. I'm beating myself in this game. Ridiculous. Okay. Jay Lippy asks, do you feel like you have enough meeples in your reserve? Hang on. I think, I think that was from earlier. Oh. It's not about how I feel, about how I win. Yeah. Coxon doesn't care about your feelings. Now, of course, there is only one tile in the game which is a crossroads. Isn't there, Caroline? Have you got it? It's already been played. Okay. So it cannot be played again. So if you somehow made it so that the tile I'd need to join up my meeple here to the field was a crossroads, oh. yeah, then I wouldn't be able to complete it. Okay. That's my goal right. in life from now on. <laughs> right. I have a new purpose, and it is Thank that. Uh, I'm going to share my notes with everybody after okay. the game. Make it a crossroads. Right, what's he up to? I'm going up yeah. there. I'm just building up my big city up there. Just doing that. I did my city. Oh, oh, the one that I had an opportunity to be part of. Yeah, but did you <laughs> mess up? Yeah, I messed it bad. Oh, right. oh. What's happened? I'm just looking at the tile you've got. It's a useful tile. I can, no. Useful. Oh, I can put it down there and get a city but the, and close off the, that will close off the field. Would that be bad? What? City. Where? Okay. Like I'm just, I'm a beginner, okay? Down here underneath your lazy farmer on the left. Um, you I? can't put that in either of no, those no. spaces because of the road. Right, I need to have another look. <laughs> look with uh, your eyes. I can put it, add it to my city and get a short road, two points for a short road. Yep. You could do or that. I can, oh, I can end the road I've got up there and add it to my city. You wouldn't end the road. I would end one end of it. Mm. Not very good, though. Is there something better? Um, well, I, uh, I could end. I could. I could end one end of the road at the top and start a new city. You could. No, I'm going to do my first idea. I think. Yeah. I think I, I, on balance, I think that's what I would do in your situation. And you are the champions. So I'm confirming. And I'm now going to play here. And you get the two points. Extending your lead to five. <laughs> uh, right. What have you got? The bow tie. Heavily featured in this game. And yeah, all it's, the it's the last <laughs> of the bow ties. Mm. Hey, remember that film? Um, I wish I did. <laughs> That is the noise of a man mm -hmm. who's got a bow tie that he doesn't want. But you can make another. Why don't you put it directly under the other two bow ties? Uh, that's what I'm thinking of doing. 
There's not really that's... any other. There's no point well, doing or... it anywhere else. Unless your big city. No, I don't want to do that. It's, it's too much of a blocking move. Blocking oh, had a lovely message from a bunch of letters and numbers who want to know if we oh. want to become famous. Yes. I would like to buy some followers. Oh. Yeah. Um, isn't there a road bow tie or is that the expansion? That is in the expansion. It's not in the base game. I am a huge base game purist. Um, I oh. like the fact that not all the tiles exist. But, yes, in I believe in the expansions there is a bow tie that has a road in it. There's all kinds of crazy tiles in the expansions. Um, I'm going to go, yeah, I'm going to go over there. Adam Maycox and everyone who's watching, I'm really proud of you for uh, your endurance. But, oh, 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 is this something I need? What's that? You've got a bendy corner -y thing. I got a bendy corner. You've got a bend. <laughs> Right, if I put it up the top and hope that I can then join it onto that road, what else could I do? You could do that. Um, I don't want to, ex I don't really want to expend another. Oh, I could use it to try and make my plan of stopping your crossroads. You could. Would that be helpful or would that give you a way to? Um, you could do that, you know, uh, but then I could I could block you from blocking if I had the right piece. Yeah. Um, up here in the with you, your top road there with the two yeah. at the top. Um, page open. Your, the, yeah. your that, that tile you have now is like Ooh. one of the only ones that can go there. Okay, that's where I'm going then. So, thank you. I hadn't really spotted that. W without so, it, I, you'd that be stuck forever. And at least that way, you can try and make that road bigger and score some more points. I mean, oh, uh, with the farmers, it's about completed cities, right? Yes, that's correct. How far through the game? How many tiles have we got? Thirty tiles. Thirty tiles. Did We're getting into the like business end. Okay, but there's no point in me putting a farmer in there, is there? That so far, there's only one. It'd be worth three points, and you wouldn't see that meeple again. Yes, yeah, that doesn't seem very useful to me. Adam says, That's "I like true. the bishop and big dude meeple from the expansion." Yes, I'm aware of the big dude meeple. Bishop and big nude. Oh, dude. It, it I like one, the big it's dude a, big dude meeple. Um, I've got a bendy corner thing as well, same like you had. I want one. And I've only got one meeple left. Oh. So. What are you going to do about it? Well, there's nothing there that really helps me because How many of your bends cunning work. <laughs> there are nine <laughs> bends in the game. And how many have we played? I have no idea. I, I mean, I do count tiles to a certain extent, but not to that. Um, ben, so what I'm going to do... When you say I'm, bend, you bend exclusively bend nothing else. Yes, just to bend nothing else. There are nine. Okay, you're uh, doing that to make it difficult for my city. Yes. Okay. Because gotcha. I can't do anything that helps me, so I might as well do something that hits. I've got the bendy. I've got the bendy. So I can You've join that. Yeah, I'm going to put it next to the one I just did. Yeah. That's my choice. Okay, Good so right. that road, which was worth two, is now worth five. Come on. I'm not going to meeple anywhere. 27 tiles remain. Okay. Um, I'm going to go... I'm going to go here and the hope that I can find the tile somehow to complete that. He found that tile. Okay. Oh, you keep getting all the good ones. Do I? Yeah. <laughs> but Make do me I? Trust. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now, okay, so I could use that to help my down below city. Ooh. And get a road. Yep. 
three points. Mm -hmm. I could also use it to complete a city and close off that field, but I don't know if that would be useful. No. Where? Where? I can't because there's no road in there. <laughs> um, you so think that closing off fields and. No, I mean, I meant it in a bad way. Right. There's an outside chance. You draw a monastery with a road which lets you join that tiny field to the big field. Is that right. from me? That, that's from Lippy G. Lippy J. That's, that's, that's a very good point. First of all, the, um, it's a very good point, though. Oh. Um, the way the tiles have come out, there are, there are still five monasteries remaining, including two that look like this. Right. Uh, and let, for argument's sake, you put it there. Yeah. That would mean that this would become part of the big field. Oh, my. But you'd need, you'd need to draw one of those and uh, hope I don't block you off from doing it okay but that's not something i can cater for at this point well you Is could it? because you could use the road um on the tile you have up here yeah and then pop a meeple mm. in a field there but pop a that would in a field. okay but sorry. that would make it easy for me to to block you or you could go this end actually and do it up here and that oh, main thing I have a chance of getting my meeple back and get it and I'm extend yeah. I'm getting one point. Okay. So the first thing I saw was that I can put it down low, add to my city, and get a three road. Yeah. Yeah, she can't come today. Um and um and then the other thing is uh, just would add one point to my road but it gives me a chance of closure yeah so and, what's best? Oh. and you put the meeple in that field which is already worth three and potentially if you got the right piece to go on the end of this road here would connect okay. it up to the big field okay and i right it's a very good point lippy yeah. j glad you're it, here there's an outside yeah and 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 if you close off that big city then i get another three points uh yeah which is something i want to do so yeah exactly because i would score a lot of points for it should i go for the outside chance hang on oh i'm looking at your square now right i don't know who am I? If you point it so that the city is on the uh, that side, on the right, it then me that means you, you could also you could and you put a, 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 fit, a farmer in the field. There's another opportunity to score three points by having someone complete that city. Okay, well. I'm going to do it. It's a big move. For someone to get three points. For you, well, you'd get three points if you had the if the farmer in the field. Yeah. It's also a disincentive for me to complete it. Okay. Here we All go. Right. So I End could game. I could go and claim that city up there. Give me take, three points. Give you three points and I take four points. Mm. Or, or mm. I could go here and claim a th and claim three points for a road. Or I could go here and prevent you blocking me. Uh, how? I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. How? Because because a piece exists oh. that fills that gap. Okay. And I think off the top of my head, there are two of them left in the game. Um, whereas if you would have blocked there with a, um, with a field at the top, I, that I would not be able to complete that city. Okay, so I've got a question for the viewers. Do you think James being the former UK champion of Carcassonne gives him an advantage in this game? <laughs> right. 
It's my turn. turn. Oh, I can I can see what you're doing here. I can complete that city and get the guy back. And that gives me three extra points as well as the Yeah. Is that good? <sighs> it's fine. Oh, what do you mean now you can see what I'm doing? Is well, there something better I could do? No, I'm just I, pissed off because you're going to get loads of points. <laughs> that's good, right? I saw the correct thing. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. No, he I'm does have an advantage because he's claiming you're drawing all the good tiles. There are no, <laughs> There's no such thing as good or bad tiles in this game. You should be able to win with whatever you draw. You get 36 of them in a two-player game anyway. Okay, so that's more points for you. Your lead is now nine on the board. Um, but the sleeping farmers are what are going to make the difference, right? Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Got a my... bend. Uh, I'm going to go there. What? Ah. Okay. It's not the end of the world. You can still do it, but I'm going to try and stop you. He's giving me a point. It's exhausting playing with you. No, I... Where can he go? Nowhere. Hang on. I could oh, place a meeple in this oh, yeah. field here, which is worth nothing, and hope to connect that up and take these points here. But I'm not going to because I've only got one meeple left. So I'm going to pass. Okay. And it's your go. Okay, I got a temperature. I've got a temple. I a can monastery. push it down by the field and get one, two, three, four, five, six points. But it'll be your last meeple. Yeah, but it's six points. And I don't get it back unless I surround myself. Yes, you must surround yourself. Surround the monastery. But six points isn't bad, is it? Uh, no, I don't think so. And we've got 20 yeah. I mean, it's hard for me to get my 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 no, that's street. The right place. Back. No, because you're trying to complete that. Trying to complete that, aren't you? Huh? I'm talking to Lippy J. Hey, Lippy J. What did he say? I can't see. Lippy J says, is that farm in the wrong place, by the way? I'm presuming they're referring to your, the last farm that was placed by you. I don't think it is in the wrong place because we're looking, she wants one of them. Caroline wants one of them tiles to go here because uh, that would join it up. Oh, uh, right. And if I draw that next, I won't have a meeple for it. Uh, yeah, but you, I, could just, you, could, you could just use it. If I... It looks like the farm at the top is in a field at the top rather than a field at the bottom of the tile. Oh, it's no, the same. It's just, a, it's just a messy it's tile. It's a crossroad. Um, um, hang on, mate. Hang on, mate. Right. If I you if I use this monastery and grab six points, I'm unlikely to get it back in a hurry. Well, it depends if you complete it or not. Yeah, but it's going to take a while. So if I then draw a monastery with the the one that I want, I won't be able to have it because I have no meeples. Well, you, you, um, you'll be able to place it and use it for the benefit of joining up the fields. Okay, right. But you just won't be able to put, put a meeple on it. You won't be able to get the extra stuff. So Okay. What should I do? Normal games of Carcassonne take about half an hour, by the way. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to do it because I'm a beginner. Oh, I'm going to go and get all these points. Okay. Rotate it so it's standing upwards. <laughs> yeah. I that's think that's where... That's can why why is the entire family in here asking me questions? <laughs> Please leave. It will be over quicker. Right. Okay. That done? Uh, I, yeah. Uh, okay, I've got that. Real game when we play with Josh, I could go there, but you'd get your meeple back. So I don't want to do that. I think I just want to take two points and run here. So I'm going to go up there, confirm placement, and take two points for that tiny road. 
Tiny road. Okay. And jump back. Oh, a curve. Oh, that's what I wanted a while ago. Oh, I don't want to join that up, do I? Mm. Not in your interest to do that. No. Can't go there. Remember, um, you have no meeples. Oh, I can't go there. Can't go there. Can't go there. So I'm just going to start a new road somewhere. Or, uh, you know, can you use that on the uh, monastery you just played? Ah. Or on the monastery you just played. Good thinking. Get a to, point. Um, to help finish it. <clears throat> yes, which way would be most useful? Uh, Adam says, can face it away from James Riyadh. A oh, road. Yep, you could do that on your on your road in the top uh, right, your top right road. You could do it so that you point it away. Hang on, oh, I need to see your cursor. Top right road, yeah. You point it away <laughs> there, yeah. so that you can't. Means, block and I get points. Yes. And you get point. So it's good. Yeah. It's good thinking from Adam. Very excellent thinking, team. Beat She's going to beat me at this, isn't she? <laughs> because you played my hand. <laughs> well, I'm not. I, you've got help from Adam and Lippy J, you know. Good. And I had some ideas of my own. Did you? Uh, no. I'm going to go here, finish my bow tie, which is going to give me some points. Mm. I think that brings me to within one. I'm not going to go in that little city or indeed in that field because I only have one meeple left. This will give me two. You have none. So that's not in any threat to me. Okay. So I'm mean... just going to pass and take those. So now I've got a snaky one. <laughs> that's, the name can... of my, uh, that's the name of my only fans account. So I could use that to extend my road... Or I could use it to either extend your road here, uh, or, or heal on my left, monastery left on your monastery, or you could uh, try and block me here by building something over the top. Block you here, show me. So down here, remember I said about yeah. there's no crossroads. If I go there, does that help? If me? you go, if if you went above it and then try to put another straight line there you would kind of block me in. But that's, you know, that's a high-risk strategy and I might be able to stop you doing it. And I'm an idiot, so... Right. What I'm thinking is, if I go... If I extend my road, I get a point, but I'm no closer to closing the road. But if I put it on my um, monastery, I get a point and I'm closer to closing off my monastery. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Look how I decided it all by myself. Adam says, I think it's James's to lose with the big field. If I complete the big field, none of the pieces I've needed have come out for me yet. They've all gone to Caroline. So maybe not. I've definitely had games where that's happened. James even if you, lose. even if there are like five or six tiles that can help you complete a thing, they've all gone to the opponent. That, I mean, just happens because of, because of maths. Um, what am I going to do with this? What, what shall I do? With, oh. I've got like a corner piece. A Um, I'm going to continue my plan to try and block you, I think. Where are you? Oh. Thanks. Down up there. Oh, but then this happened. Hey. Ooh. Hang on. Well, That hasn't got a road. Yeah, it does. You're looking at mine. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is the fabled... Um, <clears throat> tile. Where yeah. should I put it? I think I'll put it here. There we go. Ba -ba -ba -ba! Well, you have also completed my road for me and given me some points. Oh. But at the, at the moment, Caroline, you are winning the big field, which is worth 21. Okay. But you've oh. still got a little guy. I've got a guy that I could connect yeah. up with. 
I'm not getting the pieces, Caroline. I'm not getting the pieces. Well, you've got some pieces left. Oh, I don't see. I don't understand any of it. Um, what a show! Let's what go here. Doing? I'm going to go here. Load of uh, yeah, it helps you. No more that. women. Oh, and then you pick up the piece I need. Welcome to Carcassonne, everyone, where this happens all the time. Well, if I put it next to your thing, I'll complete my thing and get a meeple back. And it helps you, but it helps me more because I need to get my meeple, right? Hang on, where? What are you talking about? If I put it right next to where you just went on the left, I surround my monastery. You're, lo you're looking at my piece. Oh, Christ. Crisp. Okay, here we go. That's what you wanted, is it? Ooh. Yeah, I wanted that piece to complete the big city here. All right. Okay, I can add to my city and my road down low. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. All right, I am going to go here and pick up three points for a road. Boing, boing. Oh, now it's my go again. Yeah. Uh, oh, now I've got that one that I just had, and I, with a good idea that I can get my meeple back, right? Yeah, because you can finish your monastery. Yeah, so I'll do that. Okay. You rotten swine. Uh, I've got a piece that I don't want. I can't think of any use for it at the moment. Well, you could help add uh, complete your monastery. Oh, you didn't put your meeple on your monastery. So you no, I did. Oh, did you? I oh, yeah, did. you got it. Yeah, <clears throat> but I don't. I don't want to do that. I don't want to limit my uh, options. Okay. Well, Trying to give myself options, you know. Um, you got two guys. You got two guys. I'm, so I'm, I'm, really, I'm really nervous about not finishing, not getting in on the field, and you taking all the points. <laughs> and, and even if you did, I'm still not entirely sure that I. I yeah, so I'm going to try and find another way to get in on the big field. I think that's even if it's a long shot. I've got two meeples and there are only 10 tiles left. So um, I think there is another way to get in on it. Is there? Yeah. I don't think I will ever understand this field. You can rest assured, like, okay. if, I think if, I, if I win the field, it won't be because. I understood anything. Uh, no, I don't want to go there. I've changed my mind. Um, I, uh, I'm i just going to go out of the way um, because I think there is a way to do it, but that's that's not the time to do it with. Okay. I would have liked one of those tiles. Ooh, another monastery. Ooh, Ooh. nice. Ooh. Okay. I mean, there's um, there's one that only needs two more tiles to complete it above your monastery. And if that helps you, it helps me. It doesn't finish mine, but it help. It gives me a point. But it's worth uh, at least seven to you. And is that good? Well, um, let me just check on my calculator. <laughs> seven is more than one. Okay, so but I, end up, but I end up with no meeples again. Oh, that, that, that is true. But there are only 10 tiles left. So it's at this stage where that becomes less of a huge gamble. I mean, it could still be. But the second prize is you get some points. Now, incredibly, the tile that I actually want is now here, which means I can go there, connect oh. myself up to the big field. And that means you're winning the field. Uh, no, it means we're drawing, we're tying in the field, um, uh, and that gives me a couple of points. Uh, 
And I've got no meeples. <sighs> you ain't got no meeples. Okay, so I can put this one up there to try and to get one point and try and complete my monastery. That's going to be my best bet, I think. Yeah, could do. Oh, I should have looked downstairs and got a point down there, shouldn't I? Well, you can't because you don't have any. Uh, you don't have any meeples. No, no, but I could have added to a city. Mm, no, I oh, couldn't. Couldn't you I? Couldn't have added to not to yours. No. No. No, you couldn't have added oh, that to yours. What did I just do? You weren't oh, here. Oh, well, whatever. Okay. We're nearly done. Uh, it's my turn. Uh, that's good because I was about to block us both in here uh, because even though mm. I'd be blocked, it's. I've still got two meeples. So oh, right. But if I, yeah, if I had a, just had a, a meeple, I could have put it in that field and hoped to. Okay. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is have that pointed that way. And put it the top. Farmer. Put a, me a farmer there and try and complete that. You're and once monster. again, you have got the tile that I wanted again, Caroline, <laughs> which means I cannot finish my big city. Oh, good. So I can add to my city. Oh, I can finish. Yep. I can't finish. I can finish a road, but that adds finishes your city, so that's no good. I can nearly finish a road. I've got no, I've got no meeples. What's better? Add two points to my road or one point to my city. Hmm. Um, I mean, it's more likely that you'll complete your city. That this road here, the circular road yeah. down in the on the it's right, the problem, man, and road. my city, and my city require want... require that tile. That is the only tile that can complete the one that I've got. both of them. So. Yes. And I'm so not, if you I'm don't play it there, yeah. then this right, okay. and this road won't complete. This road won't be completed. Okay. I mean, it's got a put. It's got a flag on it yeah, as well. Make, makes sense. Yeah, but it's a it's a shame, really, because I've got the tile that you need to finish that. Yes, you have. <laughs> um, shall, shall I finish it for you? No, I'm not going to. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go up here and and score some points for this uh, heart shaped. Uh, city that I've just built. Okay. Is it my go? Okay, I've got, Here's I've your got, go. A, got a T junction. Yeah. Not very really helpful. You could you could finish your road at the top, but it would let me in. Let you into the field. To the big field. I'm not, I'm it would make you in the big that. field. Yeah, because that is worth 28 points right now, I think. Yeah, 20, okay, 24. Throw it away somewhere. And you reckon there's no that so there's now no um tile that can complete your city? No, so there's no point. Oh, no, but if I put that, if I put this down below and on my road, I would get. Two points for extending my road. Here. Yeah. You get one point. You no. have no meeple, oh, so yes, there's no... Oh, there's no... There's so not we, much yeah. value to that. You've got no meeple left, so... Hang on, would I close off... Can I close off the road at the top? Yes, oh, no, that, like would, said, that yes. would... Okay. I'd get in the field, so... But you'd get a meeple back... Which you could, I mean, there are only four tiles left. You could try and then get that meeple no. in on the field as well. No. Oh, okay, I'm just going to throw, throw it somewhere. <laughs> but, There's a beautiful symmetry in this, says Lippy Jane. Glad you're finding beauty in, in what, whatever the hell it is we're doing. Hang on, no. I would, so I would get one point rather than no points. That could be useful, couldn't it? Yeah, one point is better than zero. Hang on, let me just check on the calculator again. 
Yeah, do. I will put it there. One point is more than naught. Okay. All right. So that road is going to score four points now at the end of the game, regardless. Um, unfortunately for you, I've picked up the, the tile that I need to get myself as the winner of the big field for now. But the good thing for you is you are going to get your meeple back. So there may be one last chance for you to get in on it. Which meeple? Oh, um, my red meeple. Yeah. You're going to score uh, how, many, how many was that? That was like 10? Nine. Okay. So now you've got to figure out a way to get in on the big field. Okay. When there's remaining. Well, it's impossible, surely. Not impossible. It depends. Okay, I, I don't know which tiles are left. So I've got a city this field tile. here. If you got in this that, field uh -huh. here, if you got in this field here, and then somehow joined it up, but you'd need a bend. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if there are any bends left. Okay. And I can't be bothered to count them. No. All right, then. You'll be hoping that... But at least you'd get three points for having that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. What you got? And I, I can't really block you from doing that. Because if I went there, it would just continue the thing around. So... Right. It's not it's not really a block for me to do that. So I'm just gonna go down here and get four points for that as we move on to our last turns each. Oh, breathtaking. Nought tiles remain, and I must Oh um, it's not one you needed. Can I complete my city though? No. No. Sorry, hon. You had a you had a bit of bad luck at the end there. Uh. Hmm. Okay, so just stick it somewhere. Can I have I complete? I can't even complete my monastery or anything. I don't really sad. No, there's nothing you can nothing you can do. I'm afraid. And my curse has gone real. Oh, stop. Okay, there we go. Uh, right, but the good news is this is nearly over. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Hello. What? And sadly, the field on the right-hand side would have joined up. What? It did join up. This field did join up here. Hmm. Um, and I'm left with that thing. Uh, the most points I can score is nine by going there what? and going in the field. Uh. Okay. So now it is going to do the calculations of the scores and scoring our incomplete features. You pick up, uh, I got eight points for an incomplete city. You've got four points for an incomplete road. Uh, you've got seven for an incomplete city. We both pick up eight for incomplete monasteries. And then fields, uh, 24 for the big one for me. Uh, nine for that one down the left for me. And uh, three for... You, which means the final scores are sure. Giles Bung 126, Crobbins sure. 93. Let's just go through that last bit again. Giles Bung got 24 for field, 24, then nine, and I got three. <laughs> yeah. Propose a rematch? I think not. Not um, now, no. Not good now. Lord. I think we'll, uh, well, but that is that is Car that's Carcassonne. And at least you got to see me some angel delight. Exactly. So, that, so there you go. You know, that's that's how to play Carcassonne. In usually, you don't talk so much about the moves out loud or help your opponent as much, uh, <laughs> or have people suggesting stuff, uh, and help it moves quicker. To lose. Uh, but it's basically: does this tile help me? Yes, great. Yeah. I'll do that. If not, does this tile hurt my opponent? <laughs> yeah, then I'll do that. Or sometimes it's you need to hurt the opponent first because they're about to do something amazing. Uh, and if there's something that's scoring a lot of points, 
you've got to get in on it and at least tie for it. At least tie for it. I messed it up right at the end. Well, thank you so much. For no, thank you for the game. It, I mean, must have been thrilling for you and for all the watchers. Thanks, yes. Yoda and uh, all advice mongers. I felt very safe and protected during my first um, grueling brutalization at Cockazon. Oh, Lippy officially, officially classified as entertainment, this. That is amazing. We are longer amazing. than most Academy Award winning films. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, yeah. You could have watched Citizen Kane in the time it's taken us to play this game. <laughs> Neil says thanks as well. No, thank you for watching, guys. Ending. Thank you. Um, if you uh, follow us on Twitch, I'm uh, BG Smackdown. Caroline is. Maybe Kate's. Follow Maybe us on Kate. Twitch, please. We both have uh, Twitch accounts. Uh, also, if you go to YouTube and search for Board Game Smackdown, you'll find 30 odd episodes of comedians playing party games and things, uh, which Caroline has been on and uh, is loads of fun. You can subscribe to that as well. That is all. That's all. Let's let's wrap this up before it makes two hours. All right, Caroline, thank you for the game. Bye. And thank you for watching, everyone. Ta-ra.